Yeah, I really hate these things. The beetle grubs get in your compost pile. I think I could see why they do. You can see how much they really like rotting fruit here. This is an apple that got very ripe. And now, here we are. We have quite a few of those little beasties. My goodness. I don't know if it's good to just leave them there. The rational gardener tells me that what I need to do here is spray some isopropyl alcohol on them and kill them all. The beetle grubs are horrible. You get in your compost pile and such. But here at Adventures in Terraforming, we find it difficult to kill things unless they really need to be killed. And though I'm not too fond of what I'm seeing right here, well, live and let live, I guess. So, took no action, and they pretty much ate it. There's one guy hanging around here still. They've eaten most of that apple down to nothing. Guess I could have got a bucket of water, tossed that apple in there last night, drowned them all. That would have been a non-toxic way to get rid of this awful fig eater beetle. Ugh. Or a green June bug, I guess. Man, the beetle grubs of this thing are annoying. And it doesn't know how to friggin' fly. It's always running into you. But at Adventures in Terraforming, it's kind of live and let live. Unless they're totally destructive. I just left this apple out here because it's cool to have an apple out on your tree. Better to have an apple on my tree out front than to actually eat it. Isn't that weird? But I guess that's what I'm doing. That's what it is in suburbia behind the orange curtain.